When Miami County Visitors Bureau member Judy Rose first asked local farmers to beautify their barns with a quilt square, they were, understandably, a little confused. As we were talking to farmers, they'd say, you're going to hang a quilt on my barn? Won't it get wet? Won't it fade? And we said, no, that's not the way it works, but they couldn't see it. After they saw the result, however, the farmers of Miami County were far more willing to participate in the project in honor of Miami County's bicentennial. Once we had probably five or six completed squares done, then we started getting calls that, please come look at our barn. Is our barn available for your project? And one of the criteria that we have in Miami County is that every farmer allows people to pull off the road onto their property, get out and take pictures and spend some time if they would like. The purpose of the project is to bring people into Miami County to, to see the beauty of the rural part of Miami County. So we're trying to strategically place barns on all the major routes and off on some of the more beautiful byways of Miami County in order to present Miami County at its best. We put kind of put the project out for a bid and we talked to other artists that do this kind of work. And then when we asked Raphael what he would be happy with and he gave us a price, we decided that because he's so easy to work with and so agreeable, it was great to have Raphael on board for us. A folk artist and father of three from Mexico, Rafael Santoyo first demonstrated his skill painting murals at El Sombrero, a local Mexican restaurant. I work in many things, but I like painting best. I've done it because I like it. In the winter, Rafael rejoins his family in Mexico and works as a carpenter. In Mexico, vivo de otro trabajo. In Mexico, I live off other jobs, like carpentry, construction, whatever side jobs I can find. Yet his work on the Miami County quilt squares isn't just another job. Through his talent, hard work, and pleasant demeanor, Rafael has become an adopted member of the Miami County community. One thing that has come out of this project is we've been told repeatedly by the farmers, by the barn owners, how wonderful it is to have Raphael on their property and how nice he is and how happy he is. If there were more squares to paint, I would love to keep doing it because I love the work. When we started out, our goal was to have two squares in each township, and there are 12 townships in Miami County. So we far exceeded that goal. In the long run, down the road, we hope that the project continues on and that every few years we add new barns. I hope people enjoy looking at them as much as I enjoy painting them. We've gotten lots of media attention, and as far as we know, we've had many visitors from out of state. We do feel that Miami County, as beautiful as it is, has gotten a little improved with the project. <laughs>